Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you some tips in working with masks. So first of all, you can basically place media, whether it be an image or a video inside text or shapes. And I'm just going to delete this to start from scratch. So what we can do is let's say you want to add a video to your canvas and you want to crop your video. What you can do is double click on your media and you both see now we can go ahead and adjust the mask like so. And if you left click away from the media, you have to see now you've got your media that has been masked. And you can go ahead and also adjust the border radius. And you have to see you've got a really nice looking mask on your media. If you double click on the media again, you can go ahead and adjust the controls again for your mask. So you can play around with that. You can also select the media underneath and position it where you want, like so. And yeah basically play around with cropping your media. If I go ahead, just go back over here, just undo. What we can also do is create a text mask. So if I go to text and just bring this up like so, I'm just gonna change the font and I'll center align it. And what I need to do is simply just drag this over like so, place it at the start. And what I can do is simply select both of these layers by left clicking and dragging over the video and the text and I'm going to right click mask so you're about to see now we've got this video playing and it's playing inside the text now if we move this around you're about to see that the video is attached to the actual text but what we can also do is go over to the settings on the right panel and you're about to see you've got the option to detach mask now what this does is it enables you to move the text as the mask freely over the media and it's not going to move it along with the actual video and so having this option you can go ahead and animate your mask so let's say you want to create that same animation that I had at the start I could go for example to motion scale down and I'm going to bump up this to let's say 3000 percent and if we just preview this you have to see we've got this really nice animation I can also go and edit the mask again by clicking over here. Now I want to go ahead and just position this center like so. Click away again. And we've got a really nice looking mask on our media. Now when you detach the mask, a good thing to do if I just center this again, and you've once you've added your animations, is to go ahead and just select your media and go group. And this enables you now to move the the masked media as one whole element okay so you still got the nice detached mask animation but if you want you can move your text down like so and yeah you can play around with it a lot easier if you go into the group again you're about to see you can move your text mask you can also adjust the boundaries so let's say you want to make it 1080p like so and if I just position like so, we can go ahead and still move this around like that. So those are just some quick tips in working with masks.